Good afternoon YouTube, so trying something a bit different today. Thank you. Bloody hell. <laughs> a few people have said to me, what's the induction noise like on your S3? So what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to A record this video and B I've put a camera with a dead cat microphone under the bonnet. So what I'm gonna do now is have a, a nice leisurely drive and see if I can splice the two videos together and make one video that gives you the induction noise and features this ugly mug as well. Um, I'm not sure how this is going to pan out and it might be a video that never happens which means I'm then going to be talking to myself but that's YouTube for you anyway. Um, yeah it's I've tried this a couple of times already and it hasn't worked very well. The problem you've got is all you get from the induction noise is the sucking, the air, all the time. So I'm hoping with a dead cat on it and slightly downgraded settings on the audio, you might actually get something. So what I'm going to do is just drive cut down the partway and just accelerate through the gears so you can hear the the swoosh of the turbo and the choo-choo noises and then try and splice the two videos together and make something decent out of it. Um, it's six o'clock on a Friday night and there's loads of traffic which I thought would be gone by now but yeah bear with me. Uh, this may be a good video, it may be a complete unmitigated disaster but we shall see. It's all a learning curve, every day is a learning curve. Right, I'm going to stop talking now for a little while, which will make lots of people very happy, and try and capture some of the turbo noises. Well done, Mr. BMW driver. later I'm not too sure how this is picking up through this camera at the moment but certainly in the cab you can hear more off noise um, so people were asking what's it like inside the cabin, to be honest, it's not that bad, you can have a decent conversation, it's not too loud, um, you do get a little bit of induction noise, but you don't get that sort of roar, horrible roaring that uh, the natural aspirated engines give, I've had cars before, um, the Civic Type R was classic, um, it's a nice sound once you start getting the VTEC in, but the noise under the bonnet sort of superseded the noise of the exhaust, uh, and personally I quite like the noise of the exhaust. Um, my son says he's got an MR2 with a quad exhaust on it, a V6 in it as well, and he says that my car's noisy in his, but actually inside the cabin, I don't hear that at all. You can have a normal conversation, even on the motorway at speed, you can have a conversation, and it's not like you're shouting at each other or anything crazy like that. You know, there's a little bit more noise, you can hear the exhaust, but I like that. You know, I don't like a really quiet exhaust, I like to hear the exhaust note. And, you're here in a minute when we get uh, on song. It is quite a nice, uh, nice noise. Right, let's um, give it a little. Get back 
and basically see what I've captured. If I've captured something decent, the whole world and YouTube are going to see it. If it's rubbish, nobody's going to see it. <laughs>